Hey, hello, and welcome back to another episode of This War of Mine. Now, uh, the cold days have passed, so says the game, but OBS refused to, you know, pick up anything, so, you know, whatever, I guess. Alright, Bruno, go consume bandages. Uh, can anyone talk to each other? Oh, he's unbroken, that's cool. Just try to fix Bruno, that way I'll have at least one functional character, hopefully. Now that he's also back up to sad. And maybe we can go check out the plant farm. Maybe we can plant something. I don't know. Our things. How much water did we have? Oh, we have plenty of water now. Thankfully, the struggle seems to be coming to a bit of a pause. Plus 48 hours, huh? Alright, yeah, I'll just get that started, I guess. I mean... I don't really need it, but uh, probably better to just have it just in case. Oh, wow, that's 10 for f what? Eight water is 10, so four is five. All right, yeah, four water for five herb. That's great deal, actually. Meaning if I can really get my stuff going, then I can, um, I can try to, uh, Start making, like, medicine and stuff, like, consistently to trade. Alright, uh, talk it out. Maybe you won't fight anymore if you just talk it out. Someone's at the dough. Anyone there? I need help. Hold on, we'll be there in a second, alright? You know, I might... Um, like, like, thinking about who to send out there. Have a heart. I am having a fine. I'll send the exhausted woman out to you. I'm sure she'll be fine. She's like the only one that I can actually send outside. No! Okay, I thought they were starting to leave. Hello again. Who are you? What are you doing? We need uh, bandages. Oh, uh, shit. Fine, take it. Uh, you're saving that lens like yeah I know I, I'm regretting it already <laughs> I just <laughs> I need them to cheer up that's you know no I mean hey at least we didn't have to go somewhere because this chick would have probably fucking croaked on her way uh, can we cook more liquor? Oh, no, that's the other thing. Sorry, my bad. I'm getting them confused now. Yep. Start. No, it doesn't matter what good it will do. I, I don't really care. Alright, you guys are done. You can do that. And you can go sleep. This way I can actually make more bandages and it won't matter anyway. So I can just heal up whoever I want. This will never end. Shut up, nerd. I can make medic. I don't need it, though. I could use it to trade, though. You know what? Just go, go to bed. And Bruno here will... Cook something up. Alright, let's burn some more materials. I'm gonna assume the fact that the cold days have passed means that I won't need to... May I know, be sweating so hard on the heater... And I, I, I am, don't get me wrong, right, don't, don't mistake my calm tone for not being pissed off that uh, the cold days passed the same night that I got the better heater. But it's fine, no, it's just whatever, dude, I don't care. Hungry, depressed, and tired, that's your cue to get out there. Abandoned cottage is done. Ruined villa is almost done. Semi-detached house has danger in it. Caution advised. Construction site. Still has some meds and a huge amount of mats and some food. Oh, there's no danger at the supermarket. I mean, we might as well. It's like 70% uh, looted, right? So, I'll, I guess I'll go check it out. See what's over there. Ominous sound effects, that's fine. Just gonna march up in here and see what happens, because the game didn't tell me that there'd be a threat. 
I mean, there might be literal nothing in here, but whatever. I mean, at this point, I'm just picking clean the remainder of the town anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh no, please no, tell me that's just ambient noise. No gunfire towards me, please. I'm your best friend. What? Danger, do not touch an exploded ammunition. Any weapons I have left that may be booby trap. Do not touch anything. Okay. That's... Um... I don't know, maybe the army is just running out of bullets and they're just uh, trying to get, get it all to them, you know. And I hate to sound like a conspiracy theorist, but uh... Something don't add up here, Batman! Come on, hurry it up, hurry it up. Come on, let's just, just smash this open. Just smash. Stop the machine gun fire. I am aware of the situation. I don't need further incentive to... Cower. <laughs> Ooh, what is that? Damaged helmet. But after some repairs, it could save someone's head. Uh. Alright, I don't think I need this. The fertilizer, we don't need a lot of. But this, yes, this is all great trade supply. Uh, um. Cigarettes. Hold on, let's see if there's any more locked things. That way I don't have to bring the stupid crowbar next time. Just body slam every single door. <laughs> alright, I think... Ooh! Yeah, alright, I'm taking bandages instead of this stupid crap. Alright, let's get out of here. This place is definitely good. Hold on, actually, there is still the shed in the back. I'm just trying to make sure that there's no, like, locked doors left anywhere, because otherwise I'm going to have to start, like, you know, and then just, you know. Okay, that is not locked. That is also not locked. All right, let's just get out of here then. Oh, we're just climbing over the shed. All right. 32, all right, well, no new disaster has arisen. I'm sure there'll be another outbreak of crime or something soon. Oh, wow, this place really warmed up. What the fuck is... Where the hell are we? We've been raided. You know what? I don't care. Thankfully, we were all armed. No, no one was wounded. There was no one on defense. Slightly sick and wounded. He's lethally wounded and mentally gone. It seems that he's so very broken that I literally physically cannot move him. Alright, well, whatever. Fuck you then. <laughs> How dare you have reactions to things like getting stabbed. Very hungry, huh? You go eat something. Did he... No, wait. Uh, I, it has to be me running it through the filter. Uh, he, there's no way he drank all of our alcohol. Or alcohol, and then bandage, and then run up here. I don't know. Feed him a can, I guess. I mean, it's the list. The list, the list we can do, eh? Wouldn't mind another helping. Yeah, well, see, you get another helping when you stop being at a level where I cannot do anything with you. All right, you need to be worth something for me to. You know, actually help. I'm sorry, but that's just how it is. Uh, okay, I can make two more bandages. Sure. Yeah, sure. With the herb garden pumping our stuff out, uh, it will be great. All right, Roman, are you still mentally gone? Uh, yep, he's just checked out completely. Drink. I don't know about that. Finish the bandage and then we can bandage up the stupid man. There you go. Wow, you're doing great. Alright, fine. You know what? Let's just get fucking wasted. Whatever, man. It's not like I give a shit anymore. 
Well, at least he's on the move. I do like how he, of his own volition, opens the door and then he's like, oh, surely there's something interesting going on. Like, no, man. This is it. This is the path you chose. And it seems that helping people really isn't worth much. They just kind of fuck themselves anyway. Like, like... I remember hearing that, like, oh, helping people cheers up the people and, uh, you know, not helping them makes the people sad, but they seem to just be fucking molding anyway, so it doesn't matter. And thus, I don't care. It's just expenses that could be avoided. Now, let's go clean up this stupid supermarket, hang on. Right, let's start with the down stereos. That's where I left all the ball and stuff. Let's start from the right side and move left. Barrels. What you got for me? Ooh. ooh, ooh. One single chunk of food. Ah, oh, yeah, man. All the stuff out here just kind of sucks. But there's definitely one more trip in this. Alright, take the quality roll up. We don't need medicine anymore, it's... we're fine. Time to go home and see if anyone's dead. Oh! This wasn't argued with us? That's fine, I don't care. As long as you're just doing morale damage to everyone, who, by the way, is... Bruno is completely recovered somehow. God knows how. Um... That's fine. As long as he's not beating the shit out of people, I'm perfectly fine with that. Oh, my herbs are gonna finish soon. Oh yeah, the trader guy should show up soon, right? Maybe we can make some business with him. Honestly, I don't even know... I don't need anything in particular. I guess I'll try to upgrade this bench to the max level, which costs a few planks and... Couple electronic pieces and some parts, some components, I guess. That's honestly, that's not bad. Nah, right, we need more herb. Which means I need more waiting. So, actually, no, don't go talk to Romain. Try to cheer up the other woman. Because Roman just seems to be just obsessed with the idea of just ruining life for everyone, it seems. So it doesn't fucking matter, dude. La 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 la, someone's at the door, there he is! Yes! Can we just plant another batch immediately? No, not enough water! Well, can I go cook some snow? Or... Or did the game take away my snow when it got warmer? Because that doesn't make much sense. It did take away the snow, great. You know, I could have just put the snow in a fucking barrel, and then when it got warmer, it would have turned into unpurified water, but water never the fucking last. But whatever, I guess, uh, you know me, I'm just a wacky, wacky, wacky child that doesn't know nothing about the way the world works, don't worry, don't mind me. Bandages, bandages. Alright, we need components, lots of them. You know what, let's have... Captain Depression over here, go talk to the trading guy. This will never end. Shut up. You are just molding. Cause you are a big bitch. Oh wait, I have my snow. Well, I have one snow. But I don't have much else. Okay. Well, after a huge amount of wheeling and dealing with this idiot. It's getting cold. What are you talking about? It was cold, it's getting warmer. You pessimistic fuck. I'm thinking my stuff is best is like best best spent on making uh, alcohol to bake the bandages to make medicine as well, but like, you know, for later. Because I don't the illnesses seem to be further and further between and much easier to stamp out immediately. Rather than just the uh Rather, well, as opposed to, like, the way that the fucking bandages work, where it's just an endless struggle to get free. Actually, hold on. Um, I don't know if this is a good idea, but... 
cooking up five of these, I could buy pretty much anything I want to from the merchant guy. So, I'm just going to do that. Alright, I need some fuel for the foyer. Oh, let's make five. What good will it do? Well, you see, it can be used to cook food, cook alcohol, uh, keep the building warm, and just generally make life less miserable. So maybe if you would just start making it, life would stop sucking so bad. Every brutal sadness is just properly just erased from history, so that's good. At least someone is growing out of it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. I mean, I think I actually have enough bandages for both Bruno and uh, Roman to, like, you know, get by semi decently. So maybe. Maybe we'll be fine. This tick 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 is making me very anxious. I I don't like that. I wonder if I can make it to the guy and try to sell him some cheap drugs. Well, well, nothing. Well, um, oh wow, he doesn't have any canned food. This guy sucks. You know what? I might actually trade the booze. I'll trade for the fire and the booze. And the bullets. Very generous. See, it kind of jumps violently upwards like that, which is annoying, but other than that, it should be okay. Fine, we can have a deal. Let's deal. Alright, in the day. We doing it. We making it business. It making it work. No, no, you should all sleep in home because you are all dying. Okay, finally we can make an end to the stupid supermarket. Never have to go back there, and then we can work on whatever location I was working on before. I'm just pick and clean the town. There is only one thing that I, I very much, one place that I dread going to very much still, and that is Sniper Junction. Because I know that that day is fast approaching when I'm going to have to go to Sniper Junction. But see, the thing about places called Sniper Junction, I don't want to go to those. Because, well, I, I actually quite enjoy having my head attached to my body, you know? Without any holes in it, preferably. That, that's pretty, pretty, pretty poggers, as they say. I might actually need to use the broken helmet that I get from here to build myself a helmet. Because, let me tell you something, I would much rather have to wear a stupid uh, monkey man helmet than to have to, well, be shot in the head and killed immediately. Go loot, go get it. Oh my god. Yeah, this place is pretty picked clean, honestly, already, like... I mean, the percentages clearly are a lot more here than they were, for example, in that little house where, you know, one item was like 10% of the stuff, but... Wait a minute, is that it? Is this... really? Is that all? Did I get everything? No, there's gotta be like one more thing tucked away somewhere that I missed, right? Huh. Well, I'll be damned, I think I... Finish this place off completely. That's terrible. Well, I mean, it's good because I don't have to come back here, but the list of places that are safe to go to are getting shorter, so I desperately need Roban to get back into fighting shape. I have to say, it does show consequences I've been recovering for a month. However, well, I'm gonna have to end the episode here, so if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, hit the bell icon if you want to be notified of when there is more, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye!